Hey guys, so what's up? I sold out. I'm going for 200 mil summoning, and I'm at Dagonos to do it. No, but in all honesty, I'm just kidding. I'm actually uh, doing my Slayer task here uh, because I figured this is really, really good XP and charms, and it does cost a bit of money to kill Dagonos the cannon method, and I, for one, really don't like spending money unless I absolutely have to, especially when I'm slain. But I have been slain a lot lately, and I just figured it was probably worth doing this task instead of just canceling it, because I was just skipping Dagonos, because I don't really want to solo Dagonos Kings um, because of my internet problems, and I was just having to cancel this task because there's no way I'm going to kill the Dagonos individually. So I figured, you know, I might as well just um, get the cannon out and uh, cannon away. And I'm actually using Chinchampas. I'm not using Ancient Magics because I hate being on Ancients because it kind of screws you over for Slayer because you have to switch back and forth from Ancients a lot. Um, if you are on Ancients, because you can't use Ancients for every task, because, you know, for Ice Strike Worms and stuff, you need Fire Surge, for example. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just, I'm using Chinchampas here, and they hit fairly well. Um, I know Dagonos aren't weak to range, but since they're a fairly low combat level, it doesn't really matter. Um, because everything that's below probably level 130 and below, you can hit them with pretty much any combat style, just because their defense isn't very high. But anyways, I I just barely got here like five minutes ago, and I already have 25 crimson, so that's not bad. <laughs> I've heard it's very very good crimson's an hour here. Um, I realize it would be a little bit faster if I did use ancients, um, but they it is still pretty expensive to use ancients, and I'd just rather not do that. But anyway, uh, I have been slaying a lot lately, like this one point nearly 1.2 million Slayer XP counter. That's just from the last couple days. I believe it's been like three days since I set that counter. Um, so the reason why I'm slaying a lot is for a few reasons. Um, I decided I actually want to go for uh, not necessarily just the Completionist Cape right off the bat, although I am um, still going for the Completionist Cape. Uh, just whenever I'm in the mood to engineer or something like that, um, I'll definitely make progress towards that. But at the moment, I just want to play this game for doing something actually fun that I really enjoy, uh, and Slayer is one of those skills that I really do enjoy a lot. So I guess you could say that I'm kind of playing this game for XP. Uh, I do realize I'm not completely maxed yet since I don't have 120 Dungeoneering, um, but at the same time I am still somewhat playing this game for XP. Um, it's not so much the ranks and the high scores that I'm really concerned about. Um, it's more just that I'm doing something I really love. For example, um, I tend to spend all my XP lamps and stuff on farming, and I go on farmings every single day, even though I'm already way past 99. I'm actually past uh, two 99s in farming XP-wise, so I don't need the extra farming XP, but I just I really enjoy training farming. And um, I guess it would be kind of cool to go for 200 mils one day. Uh, I'm definitely going for 200 mil defense already. Um, that is a for sure thing that I will get as provided that I don't quit this game within the next um, few months or anything like that, although I'm really not planning on that. But um, 200 mil defense is definitely going to come eventually as long as I keep playing, provided. Uh, and I probably will. I don't really see myself quitting RS anytime soon. And so I'm just beginning to think, um, you know, other than 200 mil defense, what are some other 200 mils that I might want? Uh, Slayer is so fast these days with Drygores, you can get like, I guess, 80k XP an hour on average just by do by canceling the really bad XP tasks and doing everything else. Um, and so I'm thinking, you know, 200 mil Slayer might come one day. That's pretty far-fetched considering uh, I'm nowhere close to 200 mil Slayer, but um, I definitely might think about doing that one day. And there's... Is that guy crashing me? I guess not. He's good. Um, so, yeah, I'm just beginning to think of actually training my stats because I will eventually one day uh, finish off Dungeoneering. It might take me a very, very long time, but it will happen one day. Uh, I promise that. Even if I only do my daily challenges every single day, um, I will eventually get 120 Dungeoneering. And then, of course, we have that new skill coming out pretty soon, which um, I'll have to get to 99 as well. But beyond that, um, I still want to keep playing RuneScape. And, you know, once you have 120 Dungeoneering and I max out the new skill that's coming pretty soon, I'm just beginning to wonder, you know, what else is there to do? Um, and if I get really motivated and start going for 200 mil in XP and certain skills, that would be cool. Um, I know some people don't comprehend the uh, the draw of getting 200 mils 
Um, I guess if you're one of those people who really, really enjoys numbers, um, like I am, I've always been someone who's been fascinated by statistics. That's kind of one of the reasons I like sports so much. There's a lot of stats in sports, and I get really um, caught up in that. And I guess that has just transferred over to RuneScape as well, because I like seeing my XP go up. So speaking of my XP, let's just check on, in on that really fast. Um, I'm currently about 66.5 million defense XP, and just about 21 mil Slayer XP. So um, I guess for some people, 21 mil Slayer XP is still, you know, not very far past 99. I haven't really got into it yet. Um, but you got to realize the first 15 million of that Slayer XP I got before Evolution of Combat, and I got it without cannoning, um, so I was just doing it very, very, very slowly. I could say probably averaging about 15,000 XP per hour, and I got to 15 million Slayer XP just by doing that. Um, okay, task complete. That took literally 10 minutes. That was an awesome task. I'm definitely going to be doing that in the future. Uh, I guess I'll just splurge once every once um, every once in a while and just do that Dagonoth task. So that's the only real task that I spend money on. I bought a cannon and cannonballs just for that. So I only used 700 cannonballs that task. That's not bad. And I only used um, like 200 rich and Chompas. So I really didn't use very many supplies at all, and I got a fair amount of charms and XP out of that. So that's a pretty good task. I think that's worth cannoning, and I will be doing that in the future. I also bought a uh, an offhand chaotic crossbow just to do that task. I figure I might as well. I still have 800,000 Dungeoneering tokens left, so you know I, I thought there's probably no real reason not to buy an offhand chaotic crossbow, because I have tons and tons of tokens and nothing to spend them on. Um, so that's pretty useful for chinning. Uh, if I ever decide to go into the Abyss and kill Abyssal creatures, which I believe is still fairly good range XP, um, I would need an offhand chaotic crossbow anyway. Greater Demons, nope, we're not doing that. And let's get a good task. I would like Ice Strike Worms or um, how about Ganodermix? I haven't had them in a long time. Ganodermix, oh yes. I am, I've am. i got, got, gotten pretty good at calling tasks lately. Like I'll say, Kuridel, give me Black Dragons and I'll give Black Dragons. So I guess um, some of my favorite tasks at the moment is I really like Black Dragons because I do KBD for Black Dragons. And that's kind of fun, and you make a bit of money as well. And I really like Ice Strike Worms just because they're very, very good Slayer XP. And um, that's about it, really. Um, uh, there's some other tasks that I really enjoy, but um, those are probably my two favorites. And Automatons as well. Um, those are just an absolute blast to do, so I always get really excited whenever I get those tasks. Um, but anyway, I'm going to gear, gear up for Ganodermix, and um, I hope you guys have a good day. Uh, I only have a Slayer vlog out today, I realize that. Um, but tomorrow I might be able to make a slightly more interesting video. Um, I am working the next five days, so we'll see how that goes, um, just video-wise. When I am working, um, I'm not going to be able to get home till late because my work shift gets off at 6 p.m., um, and by that time, I will be really, really tired, so I don't know how how well videos are going to be coming out in the next few days, but I'll try my best. Um, anyway, thanks for watching this quick little, I guess, Slayer update, um, and I'll see you guys again later.